We have Eliza is calling, the one who want to do breastfeeding for me. I'm not sure why. Hello? You were talking about breastfeeding. Yes, uh, you are the Muslim Eliza, correct? Do you want me to breastfeed you? No, thank you. I'm not interested. But do you do that usually? Yeah, I say bismillah and then I breastfeed. Oh, okay. How many men do you breastfeed a day? Around 22. Okay. Is that for free, like a charity or for money? It's because we're allowed to. Oh, just because you're allowed to. Okay. Can you explain to us why your prophet allows such a thing? Because he wants us to be happy. Does oh, that make you very happy? How would it feel when, you know, like a man, he do breastfeed you? Like a man you never met before, he come to your door and he knock at your door and you give him your holy nipples. Well, do you want to find out? No, I don't want to find out, so I'm asking you. Well, I can breastfeed if you want. No, no, I don't want to find out in this way. I want to tell you, 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 you how you feel, you, sir. It feels very good. You feel very good. And what is the purpose of this breastfeeding for adult? Well, it lets you sit around with me. Okay, well, this is for you. What about the man? It allows them to sit with me. Uh, to sit with you. Okay. Uh, and uh, uh, are you really a Muslim? Of course. Of course. What do you mean, of course? How do you prove it? Ashhadu la ilaha illallah. Uh-huh. Wa ashhadu anna Muhammad Rasulullah. That's it. You are a Muslim. I believe you now. So what do you want to tell us more about Muhammad? Like what make you happy beside breastfeeding for adult? What do you think about Muta? Well, if it's there, then we can do it. If it's there, we can do it. Do what exactly? The temporary marriage. Why do they call it temporary? Can you explain? Because it's not permanent. Yeah, so what the point of it? Well, maybe just to have fun. Uh, a little fun. Of course. Okay, did you practice that before? Maybe. When you're not sure? No. No, not sure. Okay, well, I know. I, I, it sounds like you have too many experiences to the point you forgot what you had. Uh, what do you like to tell us? What is something, tell us something beautiful about Allah besides breastfeeding and forget about those things because they are very filthy. Is there something like nicer than this about Allah and your Prophet? Mm, I think you know more about it than I do. Okay, well, but I know that he is not good. So you agree with me or you agree with Muhammad? But there's loads of good things as well. But that's why I'm asking you, like what? Be nice to your parents, respect others. Uh, be nice to your parents and respect others. So, like, is it like a sign of respect when a woman, she do muta? Is that a respect? Yeah, because it's the religion. Oh, uh, okay. What do you think about Muhammad marrying children then? Is that a respect? What do you think about the rights of children? Do you think a man at the age of 54 should marry someone she is six years old? The times were different back 1400 years ago. Oh, uh, okay. So like what now? Girls, they grow at that time bigger? When they are six, like they are really big and huge? What do you think? I don't know. I wasn't there. Mm. So how you know then? You just said at that time is different. So how you know it's different if you wasn't there and this is your logic? Because when I looked online, that's what they said. Uh, so you take whatever they say for granted, right? Not all of them. Not all of them. What, there, there is something you don't like about Islam? Or all of it you like it? Mm, tell me one thing that I wouldn't like. No, you, I'm, I'm the one who's asking you if there's anything you don't like. Oh, I know what you don't like. Maybe the six-year-old thing. You don't like that? Maybe. Okay, so I'm sure what maybe mean. Either you like it or you don't like it. So do you think Muhammad? Because I'm not sure. I'm not uh, sure if he. So do you think Muhammad was, was maybe maybe he was a perverted man when he had sex with a child? 
If he did, then yes. Then yes. But uh, Aisha, she said he did. So he's yes. So why you why you believe in him then? Why you because for... some people some people say no. Some people they say, but okay, who 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 are those people? Don't we? Uh, uh, who is more can tell us the truth? The one who was there or the one who never there? Aisha, she was there, and she said that he did marry her at the age of six, and he did intercourse with her when she was nine. Not sure. Aisha, she said I that. Do you think, I don't know too much. Do you think Aisha, she did lie? Mm. Well, I don't know. Why mm. would she lie? Okay. So just to be sure that you are not uh, too young, how old are you? I'm 62. You are 62 and you want to, you are calling me to do breastfeeding for me. Is there something wrong with it? Uh, I mean, still you have appetites for men. Look, sound like it. So the agreement is still there if you want to do it. Uh, is, is it for free? Of course. Where we have to do it? In the coffee shop or like where? We can do it behind McDonald's car park. Uh, okay, look like you have a lot of expertise. Well, thank you for the offer, 62 years old, decent Muslim women. It was nice to speaking to you, okay? But thank you, we, right. we, we decline, okay? But uh, I'm sure right. there's many customers are waiting in the chat data, you know? Just thank you so much. Get your luck, you're welcome. For the accuracy. No comment. No comment. Oh boy.